It's Christmas Eve, and I saw a bunch of movies today, so I got a lot of reviews to go through. But let's start off with a really, really good movie. Spotlight. So this is the new drama slash oh, probably gonna win an Oscar movie that I um I had I was gonna go see a lot like a month ago but it didn't go in my theaters and then it changed and now it's in my theater for like one day only so I had to go see it and now I'm here and I'm reviewing it and you know what I'm glad I saw it because it was a good movie kind of slow I'll say that that is my biggest issue I'm gonna go get that out of the way the my biggest issue is the movie has slow points and there are some times where I kind of yawn I was like all right let's keep going but there are some slow moments in this movie but besides that this is a great movie and yes spotlight is a really good movie so the movie stars michael keaton mark ruffalo rachel mcadams leif schreiber the guy from ad men stanley tucci there is a bunch of people i feel like i'm forgetting someone but this movie is about a boston globe this is in boston back at, back then it was about these group of reporters who find this catholic church who have might have touched some children in some private parts and they have to go and discover them and investigate them and they're just reporters too they are realistic reporters and that is the one thing I love about this movie. The reporters, you pull for them. And every time you see a reporter on a movie, they're like always taking pictures of famous people, and you're like, oh, they're so annoying. In this movie, they are the heroes. They are the ones you're pulling for. They are the ones that get the intense situations. Man, I mean, this investigation was intense. There are some scenes when them just looking at papers, and you're reading it, and it's intense. The directing is great. I really like the directing in this movie. Can I see him winning Best Director? A hope maybe I could see him winning it, but I kind of I'm pulling for Alejandro Diantu again for Revenant. But um, he did a great job. The directing was really good. The pacing was good. But there are moments in this movie that got really slow. I was like, let's do something real quick, and I just I really liked that. And the performances in this movie felt real, especially Mark Ruffalo. I can already see a best supporting actor nomination to him. He killed it. He absolutely killed it in this movie. Mark Ruffalo, I love Mark Ruffalo. He keeps doing great movies, Foxcatcher, The Hulk, and now this. He's just on a roll. Mark Ruffalo, I can see him getting an Oscar nomination, maybe winning it, unless someone else beats him, but I could see him getting a nomination. Michael Keaton, man, he did Birdman, now this. He's on a roll. And all the Boston accents, my mom's from Boston, so I know Boston accents, all of them sounded really good. Rachel McAdams, again, she's on a roll. I mean, she had Southpaw, True Detective, now this. She is on a roll. I love Rich McAdams. Keep doing great movies like this. And then the guy from Mad Men did really good. Lee Schreiber did a really good job. Stanley Tucci did a really good job. The performances all around are great. The story is intense. It's interesting. I never knew about this thing that happened at Catholic Church. I never knew about this. So it was a really interesting movie, just like Concussion and The Big Short. Things I didn't know that I learned more about that I really liked. And I love stories like that. And three movies in a row, and it's still a great movie. But this movie is a lot better than Concussion and Big Short. This movie is a great movie. The dialogue is realistic. The acting's real. The directing is amazing. The story is interesting. It's something I want to learn more about. Spotlight was great. The reporters are the things you want. And the ending is so good. I love the ending to this movie. I love the ending. The ending is perfect. My only issue is there's a few slow moments in the movie. Some parts are like, all right, let's come on. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. But there's some slow moments, but you need that, but I understand. So I'm going to give the movie an A-. minus. Spotlight, you got to see it. It's a really good movie, and it's probably going to win Best Picture this year. I can already see it. It's probably going to get, probably going to be out, outbeat Hateful Eight and Revenant and all kind of stuff. But this is a great movie, and I really enjoyed it, and a lot better than I thought it was going to be. Anyway, guys, here's an enjoyable review, and I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys!